So, 4.6 billion years. Uh, that's a long time. Hopefully, you guys now have a concept of how long that is with the analogies of the cards and the dominoes. And also, you believe that uh, it's true, or at least are willing to accept that it's true for the purposes of learning in this course. Um, and that's great. But when we start talking about that amount of time, we need to be able to further divide it up based on the events that have happened on Earth. If we just talk about years, we'll never get around to talking about anything. And for an enormous amount of time, very little, if anything, was happening. So scientists and geologists have come up with a way to look at time in other ways. Um, what has been done is they have taken the entire amount of Earth time and divided it based on events rather than years. So some events have a long amount of time in them because not much was happening and the event was a very long time. And then some events have very little amount of time because a lot happened in not too long. This is called the geologic time scale and it's based primarily on life as it evolved from the beginning of time to the present day. So let's take a look at that and uh, see if we can deduce anything important out of it. 